gather here because we love Atlanta, we're concerned about Atlanta, we're concerned about the citizens of Atlanta. We're concerned that Atlanta continue to be the great city too large to hate and a city of love. We are clergy from across the city to stand in solidarity with the lady that we think will be the next mayor of Atlanta. Well, she has been a proven leader as president of the city council, a person who has helped to literally galvanize the way for the great things that have happened here over these recent years. She's concerned about the issues that affect Atlanta. She's concerned about education. She's concerned about the crime rate. She's concerned about our economic situation that we are facing at this time. We need someone to be the CEO of our city that understands uh, financially the crisis that we're in. And Ms. Borders, President Borders, certainly is very, very intelligent to operate in this position and understand where we are and where we need to go. Lisa will be a mayor for everyone. Yes, yes. I fully endorse the candidacy of my sister Lisa Borders. Somebody who has been rooted and grounded and who comes with the kind of capabilities that can heal our city. Yes, you know, yes. That can reach over to the Chamber of Commerce and at the same time at Hosea feed the hungry. Yeah, yeah. That leader is Lisa Borders. Yes. Yeah. Because I believe in her leadership. Yes. Our city will be a better city. Lisa Borders is our next mayor. Amen. Each and every citizen has the right to live in this city and reach their full potential. And until that day, we are not done. I stand with these pastors who have toiled in the vineyards of our community each and every day doing God's work. Amen. I want to stand with them as we continue. The work will never be complete, but I want to lift my voice and add my shoulder to the work that they are doing and the work that must be done in the city of Atlanta.